Hi uh, guys, Abdul here coming at you live from my home in Birmingham, United Kingdom and today what I'm going to start for you guys is provide you a bit of value, okay in the terms of providing you some certain tips, okay and what I'm going to call these are keys to MLM success Right guys, okay so we're going to start off with key number one, okay which is if you're doing pitching, selling, okay start using attraction marketing Right, a lot of guys, they're all the top people, they all use attraction marketing. By attraction marketing, what I mean is basically making yourself more attractive to your leads, okay? And, and you know, take a while to guess what exactly is going to happen when you make yourself attractive to other people out there. Instead of you being a basic pain up the you know, bum, right? By, by basically pitching and trying to sell your business opportunity. Okay, what is really going to happen is people are going to become more attractive to you, and they're actually going to come to you to learn more about what you're providing, okay, what business opportunity you have got, and what exactly you can do to help them. Okay, by using attraction marketing, what you're going to really be doing is branding yourself as an authority figure, uh, as a leader, okay, someone that other people who are struggling can come to, right? And at the moment, 97% people out there, you know, all over the world, right, are actually struggling in network marketing. A lot of people get into network marketing for the right reason, but at the wrong time maybe, or doing the wrong thing. By that I mean, okay, so, I mean, for example, when I got started in network marketing, uh, I got involved in a small company purely for the money, right, which is exactly what everybody does. They want money, right? That was my motivation. And um, the problem was, okay, I was actually selling and pitching, selling and pitching, and I was not getting anywhere. Right, my uplines told me, you know, go and do webinars, go and contact your friends, your family members, and basically anybody I knew, uh, you know, aka my wall market, right? Which is probably what you've been told right now to do. So if you've got an upline, they'll probably told you, okay, take some business cards or drop cards or whatever, okay, and hand them out to your closest friends and family members and just basically tell them about the business opportunity and the compensation plan, this is how much money you're going to make in this much time and so and so and that did work and it still does work okay but the more effective way now is attraction marketing purely for the fact okay that people are going to stay with you longer which is exactly what you want you don't want people joining you today and dropping off in the next couple of weeks, couple of months okay those people who are more determined maybe they might hang about for a couple of months maybe a year even just to see if they can make it work. But unless you're providing them something to duplicate, okay, it obviously ain't gonna work, all right? You probably know exactly what I'm on about because you're going through it right now, okay? You're probably struggling, and it's probably because that's what, you, what, what you're doing. You are probably trying to sell and pitch your business opportunity, and people are basically running the other way, okay? It's, it's like um, telesales people, okay? If they're calling you up with the latest contract or the latest uh, offers on so and so, whatever it may be, okay, um, and you're not interested in it, you're basically not going to pick the phone up maybe, or you're not going to answer the door if they're ringing at the bell with a catalog, or whatever it may be, okay, those people are not using attraction marketing, what they're using is called uh, cold calling, which is basically approaching people, they have no idea who they are, they don't know who they are, they're basically strangers, okay, and what we're going to do in attraction marketing is completely avoid that. So what we're going to really be achieving is less objections and more sales by recruiting more people who are going to stay in your downline. Okay, so that's exactly what tip number one is, which is use attraction marketing.